Hi, I'm Taylor Carey, and I'm doing a review on takeout for Bebop's Burger and uh, Dirt Burger. Um, this burger is 100% vegan, and this burger is just a 1950s theme um, that's a Midwest franchise. Um, this one is just in Des Moines, and I've really been trying to eat cleaner because I've been having some stomach issues. So. I'm hoping that maybe if I could, if it could compare to Bebop's, I could maybe attest to trying to be a little bit more vegan um, and eating a little bit cleaner. So here is the Dirt Burger. It is 100% vegan. Even the ketchup and everything is vegan at their store. It was a farmer. He decided that they needed more fast food chains that could be a healthier option for people. And so he invented and produced Dirt Burger. And this is also, like I said, a 1950s theme burger and fry restaurant. They're very famous in Iowa. They, I think, have five locations. So we are going to be trying those out today. Okay, so first we're going to try the original Bebop's burger and see what we're thinking here. Very good. We're gonna judge some criteria over the burgers to see which one we can kind of attest out at the end for my decision as to which one I think is better. So we're gonna test the juiciness, the taste, their appearance, also the texture, and then how it made me feel after. Because I feel that sometimes um, burgers kind of make you feel greasy and kind of yucky after you eat them. So we're gonna see how I feel after eating this burger and maybe just a cleaner version of a burger. So first we're gonna try the Bebop's burger. Which is solid. I would say the juiciness is very good. Um, you can see all the sauces and flavors that make it very juicy. The taste, pretty good, yeah. I would say there's a lot of flavors from the ketchup and the pickles and the it's very good. The appearance is um, probably not as good as this one for comparing. This one's more like the texture is pretty good. I mean, I'm kind of used to it, so I can't really say the texture's bad or anything. I guess we'll have to tell in like five minutes about how I'm feeling after it. Okay, so now we're gonna dive into the 100% vegan burger from Dirt Burger. I'm kind of nervous. I've never tried to eat vegan before, but you can tell. It looks a, diff a little bit different in the color of the meat. A thicker patty, I would say, um, but also still has the pickles and the lettuce and some coleslaw, looks like, at the bottom. So we'll try this out. Hmm, pretty good, actually. Um, has a lot of flavor, which I was kind of nervous about. The texture tastes like a normal burger, in my opinion. Um, it's definitely a lot bigger. Appearance in this one, I would say, is better than this one. Um, kind of, it looks different to, to, compared to a normal burger, but for being 100% vegan, it's pretty plump, and it's got it's got a lot of stuff in there. I mean, and it's very circular, and yeah, the bread looks really good. It's definitely juicy. I mean, I think it's all the sauces in there. I almost like this one better. It's more crunchy. So comparing the two, the flavor is pretty equal. This one, I would say, is upper hand a little bit. Appearance, I would have to go with Dirt Burger having a better appearance. It looked cleaner and nicer and overall bigger than this one. The more stuff was in it, which I tend to like in my burgers. The texture, this one's a little bit different, so I can't say it's bad. It's just different in my opinion, but it doesn't taste like it's nothing that I'm like, mmm, I don't know. Like it's it's still very good. I feel like this one, you can just taste the grease. You can almost feel it, like just kind of sitting in my stomach. This one, like you feel full, but it's kind of like an airy full. Like you don't feel like you're gonna puke if you eat 20 of them. I feel like I can go for a run after eating a burger, which is, can't really say that very often. Juiciness, I would honestly say this one is, I don't know if it's because it's full of grease or if it's just better overall, but I feel like this one normally drips out of my mouth <laughs> and it's so good. So I think in conclusion, Dirt Burger overweighs Bebop's, which is super surprising because I've been to Bebop's for probably five years and I love it. It's been my favorite burger overall. Price-wise, this one was $7 
and this one was 450 I think. So the price wise is pretty good. Surprising because this one is 100% plant based. Overall, I would have to say that I'm going with the Dirt Burger. The appearance was better, in my opinion. The taste was better. The texture was better. It was pretty equally juicy of a burger. And I felt better after eating it. So thank you for watching. I would definitely check out Dirt Burger if you haven't. And also, you gotta try the classic and original Bebop's Burger.